Hey guys, Aubrey here. Today I'm doing the Eureka Math Grade 2 Module 4 Lesson 3 homework. So let's get started. Number 1. Solve using the airway. The first set is done for you. Okay, so A, 67 plus 20. So I just did it straight plus 20, which is 87. But 67 plus 21, they first added 20 and then added 1. So plus 20 is 87 and then plus 1 is 88. And 67 plus 19, they added 20 first and then they subtracted 1. So let's see, let's try B. 56 plus 40. So I'm just going to add 40, which is 96. And 56 plus 41, first, plus 40, which is 96, and then add 1, which is 97. And now 56 was 39. So we're going to add 40 first. And then minus 1. Because it's easy to do that. Until you get 95. Alright, now C. 68 minus 40. Just minus 40, which is 28. Now 68 minus 41, so 68, first minus 40, which is 28, and then minus 1, which is 27. And 68 minus 39, I'm just going to minus 40, which is 28, and I'm going to plus 1, because we did minus 39, so that makes 29. All right, now D, 87 minus 50. That's 37. And now 87 minus 51. So first minus 50, and minus one, which is 26, I mean not 30, 36. Now 87 minus 49, first minus 50. 37 and then plus 1. That's 38. Okay. Alright, next page. Number 2. Solve using the airway, number bonds, or mental math. Use scrap paper if needed. So A, 40 minus 20, so I subtract 20. That's 28. So then minus 21. You're subtracting one more, so you're taking away one more. So then that should be less than 20, one less than 28, which is 27. And now minus 19, you're subtracting um, one less than the original. So that should be 29, because it should be greater, because you're taking away less. Okay, and now B, 86 minus 50, that's 36. So if you're subtracting more, then this answer should be one less. Now I'm subtracting less, then this original answer should be one more. Okay, so now C. So 37 plus 40 is 77. So plus 41, that should be 78. And plus 39, that should be 76. Alright, now D. 62 plus 30 is 92. If you're adding one more, that's 93. And if you're adding one less, then that's 91. 77 minus 40 is 37. If you're subtracting more, then it should be one less. If you're subtracting less, it should be one more. All right, now 28 plus 50 is 78. If you're adding more, that's 79. If you're adding less, that's 77. All right. Now number three, Marcy had $84 in the bank. She took $39 out of her account. How much does she have in her account now? So 84 minus 39. Let's subtract 40 to get 44. We can add back that one that we subtract. So the answer is 45. That means she has $45 in her account now.
All right, and number four, Brian has 92 centimeter rope. He cuts off a piece 49 centimeters long to tie a package. Um, how much rope does Brian have left? All right, so if he had 92 and he took away because he cut 49, then how much does he have left? 92. I'm gonna subtract 50 first. It's 42, and then add back that extra that we took away. It's 43. So that means Brian has $43 left. Oh, I'm not, not 43. Oh my god. We're not talking about money right now. I was looking at that. Brian has 43 centimeters left. Now B, to tie a different package, Brian needs another piece of rope that is eight centimeters shorter than the piece he just cut. Does he have enough rope left? Okay, so he just cut 49 and he needs um, oh, sorry. so he, he needs another piece of rope that is eight centimeters shorter than the piece he just cut. So he just cut off 49 centimeters. Um, and he needs a piece that's eight centimeters shorter. All right, so 49, that's eight centimeters shorter. That's 41. So he has 43 left and 43 is greater than 41. So that means, yes, he has enough left. So yeah. All right, thank you guys so much for watching. I hope this video helps and please don't forget to like and subscribe because it really helps on my channel. See you guys next time, bye.